Good morning, gamers. Welcome back to the Game Shop's basement, where we are cooking up for you the Loft Project, the largest online fantasy tabletop experience ever. So today, I've got uh, two or three more ideas. We're going to get up here on YouTube real quick, uh, stuff people have been asking about. i um, going to try to get something up here almost every day to kind of flesh things out. So one of the things that people have been asking me about lately has been about character generation. So let's get into this idea here real quick of the equipment packs. Now these equipment packs that I have on our picture today for our YouTube video, um, they actually come from Beckme. So we are using Old School Essentials as our base game engine. And so, you know, just today somebody was asking me, hey, how do I make a character for Old School Essentials? So, you know, we're going to get into that because there really isn't like a uh, an OSC Beyond website, like there's a D&D &D Beyond website. Um, so, but there should be. Anyway, not that I'm volunteering. I'm already doing a whole lot of stuff. But if we, um, so this uh, Beckme stands for Basic Expert Companion Masters Immortals, B-E-C-M-I. And those were the box sets that came out for box set D&D back in the day. So when I got the basic box set for Christmas in 1982 and then uh, followed it up, uh, you know, uh, my birthday came a few months later and, and I got the expert set at that point, you know, and, and, and then, we, then I had to wait because uh, uh, back then all they had was basic and expert. They didn't have the, the companion set wasn't out yet. Um, so then when I turned 14, I just went to AD&D, which was the, the hardbacks, people remember. But the, um, so Beckme, uh, in one of the Beckme adventures, they came up with these adventure packs here. And so one of the things that takes up a lot of time in creating a character, uh, you know, even if you're really proficient at rolling the dice, um, coming up with your stats real quick, and if you play a really simple character, uh, like a fighter, you, know, you can slap that fighter together in like probably less than a minute. Um, but then people are like, well, now I've got to go shopping. And so they'd roll up their starting gold pieces and they'd look at the pages of the rule book and they'd go shopping and it would take a long time. Um, and I have this really cute picture of my younger daughter um, shopping for her first character. I put that up on social media a while back and it is cute to watch her do it the first time and we used it as a math lesson in homeschool. And she started, I think, with 120 gold pieces and had to shop, you know, out of the book. But it, when you're trying to make a character real fast, um, you know, that's kind of a long time investment. And you don't really stay with that starting stuff anyway. As soon as you adventure, it's going to change. You're going to use up your torches. You're going to acquire gold. You're going to acquire magic items. You're going to acquire, you know, different stuff. Um, you know, maybe you use your 50 foot of rope in a um, situation where you can't get it back. Or maybe you use your 10 foot pole and um, use it to trigger a trap and then the trap actually destroys the pole instead of you, which is good, you know, because it's a little easier to replace a 10 foot pole than it is to replace your dead character. Um, or, you know, whatever, if you burned up those flasks of oil or you whipped out the, that holy water and splashed it on some undead, you know, you're not going to you know, that it's not like your strength stat, which is pretty stable most of the time. It's not like your intelligence stat, which is pretty stable most of the time. That equipment is going to change. Uh, your equipment list is going to change. So um, so we want to get you a starting equipment list, you know, to kind of start the first scene of your first session as quickly as possible. And so there's adventure pack A, B, and C here. Um, so this came from Beckme. So this is old school. Our old school essentials uh, is the base game engine. Uh, for our loft project, although we are blending in a little bit of Beckme, a little bit of basic expert companion masters, immortals, the box set D and D, and the one E hardback D and D, just a few things here and there. Like for example, um, so far old school essentials doesn't have a monk, doesn't have martial arts, and uh, it's just not our favorite game without that. At least not in my opinion. Um, so we're kind of bringing that in from Beckme and one E. Um, so that's an example of something that, that we might bring in from Beckme, or that we are, definitely that one, um, that we're bringing back from Beckme and 1E. So these adventure packs, so when you make a character for the Loft Project, for the largest online fantasy tabletop experience ever, when you make a character for that, you could go shopping, you could roll some starting 
uh, gold and go shopping if you wanted, if you really want that experience. Or you could take a melee weapon appropriate to your character, a distance ranged weapon appropriate to your character, um, armor appropriate to your character, a shield if a shield is appropriate to your character, um, and one of these packs. Um, and that would be just quick, easy, quick, easy done way to you know get your character ready for your first session equipment wise. Um, down below in the doodly doo seems like it's getting longer all the time because I'm having more things to add down there. Uh, not only do we have our Discord to reach out to us, we've got our uh, survey where you can um, uh, give us feedback on what you're looking for in a gaming experience. We can, uh, but we've also got uh, today. I'm adding down into the doodly doo the link to the free old school essentials basic uh, basic rules. Now the basic rules are just going to have cleric, fighter, magic user, and thief. Okay, but they're free, and if somebody wants to try this and see what it's like or take a peek at it, that's a free way to do it without spending any money. Now the advanced old school essentials rules, they're going to have your bards, your rangers, your paladins, um, you know, your assassins, your acrobats, your more exciting stuff. Um, or if you wanted to play a monk and you're like, hey, where do I find the rules for a uh, Beck me or one e monk. Hey, just say hey on Discord. Let's you know. Let's know you're interested in that. We'll steer you in the right direction. Uh, but in the meantime, uh, I will see you around the gaming table.